DJ Fluker will work out at the Alabama Pro Day. He's down to 330 pounds and in terrific shape via DJ The Warrior. Um, I think that's his Twitter name. So, yeah, um, DJ Fluker, he was a highly touted prospect coming out of Alabama. You know, um, by this video right here, you can tell why he was highly touted. You know, he looked like a, a built offensive lineman on Madden. You know, his only issue is his like body control. Like, you know, he's a very big person. He can maul you, but he has a hard time getting that block on the opposing defender. But that's something he could work on, like simple stuff like that. But other than that, you already know. He already looked like he has his strength. He looked like he benched at least 500 pounds, squats at least 650, to my opinion based off how everything look um this is him at crunch fitness you know getting that work in you know right here he looking like a guard to me a guard could pull him he looked a little bit faster he was a highly touted prospect um i think he went in the first round to the chargers but that didn't work out so he hopped from team to team you know he was always good for that power scheme but not that zone scheme you know but he's been working out so he might be good for um the zone scheme now we could test him out and see give him a little cheap deal let him compete in our room and maybe we could get a high value for a cheap cheap price you know um fluker he was already on the dolphins but i don't think he'll be opposed to coming back to the dolphins um i think fluker is like six four and a half six five like they said, 330. Um, the fact that he was more than this was crazy because I feel like coming out of college, he was like 325, 335. But right here, it looked like it's straight muscle. Straight muscle. Looked like Larry Allen in um, the bench press video. That's what he looked like. But I know he not on Larry Allen level. 700 pounds, I don't know if he on that level yet. <laughs> is we definitely gotta sign up we gotta put him on the dolphins and so you could just put people on their back 700 pound bench man you kidding me you better put them at guard and center at the same time so we could put another raw receiver oh we don't need five linemen we could put four but ain't no old lineman that good to the point where you could put four and you'll be good ain't no way but yeah um dj fluker is somebody we definitely should keep an eye out for at the Alabama Pro Day. I'm pretty sure we will be there if he is capable of playing tackle. That's what worries me about him, him playing tackle. I wouldn't want him on Tua's blind side, but we would have to put him there because we already got Tehran. So the only thing he could play for us is guard or center. We gotta put him in a Miami Dolphins uniform first, put him on the roster first, and let him compete it out with our people. We just signed Dan Feeney. We could sign him too. Um, by the looks of it, it seems like we're gonna draft somebody for the old line in the draft with our first pick. So whoever that is, they're gonna come and compete. Hopefully they win and end up being like an all pro instead of us taking flyers on these dudes that haven't proven anything in the league. No offense against DJ Fluker, but still, I just want the for sure thing. And I know DJ Fluker, he has the potential to be the for sure thing. He's a first round pick for crying out loud. So he does have the potential. We just gotta get out of him. He looked like he could block anything that's coming his way right now from this little video. He definitely looks lean in this little picture right here. Very lean. For somebody who's 330, looking this lean is kind of scary. You know, he doesn't have a gut. Looks very athletic. Yeah, he been putting that work in, it looked like. You know, he, he, right here he wrote, y'all thought I was done. Y'all thought I couldn't lean out and get 100% healthy. Y'all thought it was impossible. Y'all thought it was a fluke. The only thing impossible in life is giving up. 
for all y'all that fell off and put me on the back burner i'm back you know so he got something to prove right now and them players who got something to prove i like them because if they got something to prove they willing to do it on under any price any price that we give them and once they prove they worth if we want to give them the money we could give them the money if we want to let them go we could let them go but at least we got that production out of them because they got that fire inside to perform better and to be on that top tier level that they think they can be so hey dolphins y'all gotta look into dj fluker man this is him when he um first came to the dolphins he had the goldilocks on you know he looked like a monster he got huge arms i'm not even gonna lie his arms look like legs right now huge arms bro he got a long wingspan he just he got the perfect build to be a old line but hey y'all let me know if we should sign dj fluker on the team um do you think he has the potential to be great as we once expected him to be or do you think um his time is up in the league and he should go to the xfl arena football stuff like that y'all know but y'all let me know in the comments i'm going